Okay, I know I love school and everything, but I am so excited for this summer. Yeah, I just have no idea what we're gonna do. We'll figure something out. Okay, then what should we do for two months straight? Hmm. Oh, what about we jump off the side of a cliff into the ocean? Um, no thanks. Okay, we could go skydiving. That would be exhilarating. Eh, uh, fine. Hmm. <gasps> Annabelle! Ow! Are you okay? I'm fine. I think you tripped over this. A piece of paper. It's probably just a piece of trash. I'd throw it away. Now, come on, we gotta head home. My parents might worry. Um, you can go ahead. I'll catch up in a second. All right, don't be too long. Okay. There's a message. If you are reading this, you are special. Take this paper and do not lose it. No more can be said. All you must do now is wait. Hey, Annabelle! Oh, she's gone. Annabelle, wait up! Hey, Annabelle, so you know that piece of paper you told me uh, to throw it's away? it's so good to be home and... Oh, yeah, what about it? Well, I sort of took it home, but before you ask why, um, it had a message on it. A message? Yeah, it said to keep the paper and not lose it. Here, I'll show you. Olivia, the paper's blank. Wait, but there was a message on it. I swear it said something. I don't think so. It's not like the message can get up and walk away. Annabelle, I'm telling you, there was a message right on this paper. It... It told me I was special. Olivia, you do have a really wild imagination. Are you sure your mind isn't just making all of this up? No, it had to be real. Mm, never mind. There's another message. Annabelle, look, another message appeared. Olivia, the paper's still blank. Maybe you need some rest. It's been a busy day for the both of us. What? No, Annabelle, you have to believe me. It just said something on the paper. Sorry, Olivia. I really do believe you need some rest. Why don't you go lie down? Um, I'm okay. Thanks. It seems that every time I unfold the paper, there's a new message. She may not believe you, but you must trust your instincts. There's something in your pocket that will help you and Annabelle start your journey. Take it out, hold hands with Annabelle, and it's up to you to decide the rest. <sighs> okay. Hmm, well that's new. Hey Annabelle, can you come hold my hand? Uh, sure. What's this for? Hey, where did you get that? <gasps> what the heck just happened? Where are we? Whoa, this place is so cool. Olivia, what just happened? What did you do? Don't get mad at me. It was the magical paper. What? Don't worry. We're not in any danger. And uh, I know how to get home. Sort of. Olivia, we need to get back to my house. I don't even understand how we got here. Calm down. It's okay. It's hard to explain, but I think we were teleported here for a reason. Teleported? Seriously, Annabelle, I'm telling you right now that we are meant to be here. Just calm down. <sighs> okay, fine. So how do we get home? Well, we're not gonna leave right away. Look around. This place is awesome. Yeah, but no, I'm not comfortable with any of this. I just want to go home. Annabelle, it's summer. Don't you want to do something exotic on your first day of vacation? Well, I don't know. Everything here, it's different. I don't know how I feel about this. Oh, come on. Let's just do a few things, please. Fine, but just a few things. Thank you. Hey, look, there's a trail of arrows. I think we should follow it. Olivia, that could be dangerous. I don't think so. I'm gonna follow it. Uh, well... Well, if you're going, I'm going with you. I was hoping you were gonna say that. Now come on, follow me. Okay. Annabelle, look! Those arrows led us to this awesome tree. It looks kind of dangerous. It's not dangerous, it's perfectly safe. Now come on, we have to climb this. Olivia, I don't think that's a good idea. Trust me, we'll be fine. I won an award in the third grade for climbing a tree. I was the cool kid on the playground for a whole week. Oh my gosh, well, it's just too high up. I I'm not going. Really, Annabelle? Not even for the fun of it? I don't know, Olivia. It's just another thing I'm not comfortable with. All right, well, if you don't want to go, we don't have to. Really, I know you want to climb the tree, Olivia, and I have to admit, it would be fun, but it just, it looks too risky for me. I understand. You sure? I'm sure. Now, why don't we go over there and look around? There's probably some less dangerous things over there. Okay, let's go. Oh, it's a squirrel! A squirrel? Olivia!
Olivia, run away right now! Annabelle, can I talk to you about something important? Um, I guess so. Okay. Ever since we got here, I've noticed that you don't want to do anything because you're not comfortable with it. Yeah. Well, have you ever heard the quote, a comfort zone is a beautiful place, but nothing ever grows there? Yeah, I've heard it. Well, I believe you should think about that quote right now. Annabelle, do you always want to look back at your life and think, I can't believe I did that? Or do you want to look back and think, I wish I did that? It's your choice. Wow, I never realized how much I avoided because of my fears. Well, I have. So yes, some things in life are scary and a little risky, but they're also another opportunity to experience something new. Sometimes you just have to look at life in a different way. Maybe you're right. You know what? I am ready to look at things in a different way. I'm ready to experience something amazing. Well, it took you long enough. <laughs> Come here, you. Now what do you say we do a little more exploring, this time on the wild side? <laughs> okay, I'll help you up. Walk through life. Every day is a new beginning. Shine your light. It's a day and the world is waiting. Move along to the song singing in your soul. Feel the beat, clap your hands, let it take control. Okay, I think I've had my fair share of fun today. I'm exhausted. <laughs> yeah, but I have to admit, I had a lot of fun today, Olivia. Me too. Now, what do you say we head home? Sure, you do know how to get home, right? Yeah, I think. <laughs> now we just hold hands. Okay. Wow, we're actually back home. Yeah, I guess we are. Annabelle, I'm really glad we spent this day together. Me too. And Olivia, you taught me something very special today. Thank you. Of course. And I'm sorry for not believing you about that message thing earlier. That's okay. I wouldn't even believe myself either. <laughs> I love you, Olivia. I love you too, Annabelle. <laughs>